Erin. When I first started at Southwest, I often heard about the famous Mr. Trimpey. Yet it wasn't until track season that I finally met you. I quickly realized how impactful you are on to, all, to all of those around you. You're the most energetic, selfless, selfless, passionate, trusting, and caring man. Since I was a little girl, I prayed for someone who would support me, care about me, challenge me when I needed it, push me to be my best self, who could make me laugh, and most importantly, love me for me. I'm the luckiest girl in the world because I found all of that in you. As you know, I'm the most indecisive person. <laughs> But one decision I never had trouble making was knowing you were the one I wanted to spend my life with. Erin, thank you for being my best friend first, my boyfriend, fiance, and finally my favorite, my husband. Thank you for building the bones with me for a strong and lasting relationship. Thank you for being my home. I'm beyond excited to continue building a life together and see all that we can accomplish together. I promise to always listen, even if it's a ridiculous weather forecast calling for 20 feet of snow or preparation for your fantasy football draft that you'll just trade away your whole team throughout the season. <laughs> I promise to be faithful and honest with you always. I promise to always support you, whether that's accomplishing something by trying something new or receiving the Trumpet Trophy. <laughs> I promise to love your family as my own. I promise to be the calm in the storm and remind you that everything will be okay and I'll always be there when it's not. I promise to always drink bush light proudly with you. I promise to do everything in my power to make our little farm and woodshop dreams come true. Lastly, I promise to love you unconditionally and be your best friend. Aaron Samuels, I love you the most of the times of infinity and beyond, and I want today, because <laughs> I got to say it first. And I cannot wait to be Mrs. Trimpey for the rest of my life. Love always, your wife. Love you. Love you too. Dear Jenna, I can still remember the first day that I met you at Southwestern. Yes, I thought to myself, there's just something about her, and I really want to get to know her. I can remember running with Coach Goss during cross country and her telling me that you definitely need to start talking to her and ask her out on a date. Why haven't you done that yet, were her exact <laughs> words. Little did she know, we started talking, and five years later, I have found my best friend. I can remember when I was young, still just farming carpet in my parents' living room, and I always thought I'd find someone who likes farming, the country, the outdoors, and just likes me for me. She was always blonde, of course, too. I just want you to know those details. But it's like a dream came true because I found the perfect girl I was always looking for. Um, before I met you, my Mimo told me that my pap had one wish. He said he wished wish that I would find someone because he said no one deserves to go through life by themselves. I know he's smiling down on us today because he knows that I found the one. Jenna, please know that I will always be there for you in the darkest, coldest of nights. And even when your to toes are way too cold and I can't handle it against my body, but I'll still be there. And the brightest of days of our lives. No matter what we choose to do with our life, you'll always be in my heart and my soul because together we can accomplish anything together. Even if you just want to be mad for a while, and I can't talk to you, I can't wait to spend this day and the rest of our days holding hands and saying, I love you the most this times infinity and beyond. I love you, babe.
holding on through all the years Looking back brings me to tears Oh, I wanna see this through All I know is how I feel And all I want is what is real hours apart I had known about Aaron long before getting to meet him in person but when I finally got that chance I remember thinking wow he truly matches her energy after seeing the two of them together I could tell that they brought out the best in each other and were meant to be the love that they have for each other and this fear is quite evident <laughs> so Aaron thank you for being an amazing partner to Jenna for making her happy and allowing her to be herself for supporting her, loving her, and for always putting her first, I know that she is in such good hands. So to close this out, I'm wishing both of you so much love and happiness as you begin your new journey as husband and wife. Take care of each other, listen to each other, grow with each other, and never stop having fun. Now as Jenna knows, in college I studied psychology, which has a bigger focus in statistics. So before I end this, Jenna, Aaron, if you guys could just look at each other in the eyes real quick, just real quick, look at each other. Look at each other? All right, great. You're now looking at the person who, statistically speaking, is most likely to murder you. And on that note, I'd like to make some toast, so if everyone could raise their glasses. Cheers to the new Mr. and Mrs. Trimpey. I love you both. Congratulations. Although there are many things we wish to forget about the pandemic, the one thing I will never forget is how our relationship grew stronger. Jenna and Aaron will come to our house daily during the pandemic. We didn't abide by social distancing. <laughs> but during the cold winter months, we mastered the game of Mario Kart. I was impressed by Jenna's Mario Kart abilities. A Aaron and I are on the 50cc level, and Jenna's on the 200cc level. Okay? <laughs> we would even practice wrestling in our living room. In fact, you might see Aaron and I wrestling on the dance floor tonight. <laughs> The match won't last long, so don't blink. <laughs> Aaron's an amazing brother, an amazing son, a grandson, the best uncle we could wish for, a friend to many, and now a husband. Aaron, Jenna, I'm very fortunate to be a part of your life. The two of you truly are a perfect match. I wish you a marriage full of happiness and love.